Race number seven here at the Vile today. Strange Magic moving it. Set to go already and racing away to a good start for them. Runway bomb, Vix Princess, and on the outside, Magical Flight were the first three to respond, with behind that River Carares trying to get over from the deep draw. What a honey's along the inside. Lucy in the sky is further back with Strange Magic, and in the beginning, and second breath will be the trailer, racing a good seven, eight lengths off the leader as Runway Bomb sets a good gallop up front as they reach the home turn, a thousand to go. Runway Bomb by two, Magical Flight is second, what a honey. Vix Princess is racing awkwardly on the outside. She had her head twisted for a stride or two over there with the white cap behind that in the beginning river Carraris and strange magic is six lengths off the leader second breath is right down the inside the two shades of blue and lucy in the sky will have to come from last the seven lengths off them as runway bomb continues her momentum heading down into the final 600 meters by two lengths from magical flight in second in the beginning the far side with water honey down the outside the white cap of vix princess still three and a half four lengths to go then second breath being pushed along river Carraris and behind that strange Magic and Lucy in the sky entering the last 300 meters. Runway bomb in the beginning emerges as the principal danger down the inside. Vix Princess is being rousted up on the outside, also coming home. And then behind that came What a Honey and River Carraris inside the final 100. And in the beginning has picked it up strongly here. In the beginning on the outside is Vix Princess. It's in the beginning though from Vix Princess in the beginning. Beat Vix Princess. Third runway bomb, River Carraris in Strange Magic and Magical Flight. Lucy in the sky, second breath and what a honey. So it's nice to have Joey Soma with a double in the last week. This is a bread by Kyvan Studd. Well done to Vanessa Williams. She sent me a message when my horse won on Friday, I think it was. So that's the return to you, Vanessa. Well done with your daughter, captain of all out of the Windrush Mayor, Rashuli Breeze. In the beginning, ridden to victory by Chase Morjan, challenged the long-time leader runway bomb, went away from her, and then on the outside, Vix Princess, the hot favorite, uh, did do the most challenging at the end. Joey, well done to you. Nice to have you in the winner's box here at the Vile and get better quickly. In the beginning wins race number seven. Well, in the beginning, as a comeback uh, to winning ways, it is still a lightly race career, as I pointed out, just the 10 runs after this afternoon's uh, victory. That was a uh, victory number three from those 10 outings. Last win was uh, some 278 days ago. Now, it is um, Nelio looking after, in fact, uh, receiving the check on behalf of Miguel, who looks after in the beginning and well-related in the beginning. And please uh, pass on our congra congratulations to him. Thank you so much. Uh, just I want to say thank you to my boss, to the whole team and well done to the owners, special chase. So I, we really appreciate where the, where the, just, uh, is, where, where, where the sports betting, yeah, okay, just want to say. All right. Thank you. We appreciate it. Thank you so, so much. Appreciate you coming back. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you so you much. much. That's for Miguel. All right. Not uh, so long ago, we were talking to Chase. It was a horse coming off a lengthy break. This one comes off a lengthy absence from uh, the winner's box. But from the beginning, in the beginning, was always uh, highly regarded. And today showed some of that ability. Yeah, listen, last time, who was scratching our head, she ran terrible. I mean, she was never in the race, never traveled. But insane, we were drawn on the inside of the turpentine track. So it stands out usually a bad draw. And I probably, she probably needed the run as well. But mm -hmm. during the work, I, during the week I worked, and I said, you know, so she's not quite pretty. And he said, you know, we haven't tried yet. It's blinkers. So let's put the blinkers, go the 14, and uh, he was right. It worked out well. Indeed. So uh, two uh, brains uh, together, or is that two two brains better than one? Yeah, luckily it worked this time. You know, sometimes you get it wrong, but uh, all answers are so enough for the chances and small yard. But at least we're getting back on track and made long continue. And your feelings about the other uh, runners earlier on? They were just needing it, or perhaps wants to keep an eye. I think um, Mr. Hannigan uh, was throwing. A head a bit ahead about a bit when you're going down to the start and the one earlier on anytime champ no anytime champ is very disappointing they, they also can't get to the bottom i don't know we've tried everything with him but he just doesn't put it in and uh, miss hannigan i think just a bad draw plagued it uh, that's why i think he should have draw should be in the first three okay now we wish you guys and please give our regards uh, to joey we wish you guys all the very best uh, for the uh, coming a uh, few months as the season progresses yeah and it's just some of the time he said last year's on change of stick so i'll change our stick for you well done <laughs> very well done uh, to joey and of course there's 
as we uh, bring in Mr. Chinsami. This was the telltale sign yes. with his uh, loyal <laughs> friend. It is now well, 11. Colors. <laughs> yeah. How many wins now since uh, he's been coming uh, to the races? Uh, no, nine. Uh, nine. Ten out of 11. <laughs> ten out of 11. No, it was, nine, eight, it was eight out of 10. Now it's uh, nine, nine out of 10. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well done to Mr. Chinsami. This was well related. Yes. And uh, from the beginning, the beginning, highly regarded and uh, certainly has uh, gone back to that sort of performance. Uh, the first thing I want to say is, uh, uh, what you guys, what you guys, in business and in life, and what you in what you guys, everybody knows it. You go through ups and downs. I mean, sometimes you're the top winning group ones and whatever the case is. What you guys, Mr. Soma has gone through. Uh, uh, what you guys, uh, for the last couple, uh, maybe the last year and a half, whatever's gone through a bad time, when you knee operations. What you guys, uh, what you guys, he hasn't, he hasn't been himself. Uh, what you I reached to him a couple of months ago and he said, Darren, please, what you guys, uh, what you guys, uh, uh, please believe in me and uh, what you guys, I believe in him. I mean, the man uh, has given me, uh, what you guys, the greatest success in, in racing and I don't think I will ever uh, achieve it with anybody else. So, what you guys, uh, there comes a point in life that you have to be loyal, mm -hmm. uh, you have to respect you have and, and uh, what you guys, you can't just turn your back on, on a person. So, as well as same as Soma, you know, it's been hard. People have been, you know, uh, you know, people are, mm. what you, when you're on top, everybody loves you. When you're on the bottom, everybody wants to talk about your stats and whatever the case. I believe in him. Uh, what you got more than that, what you got as a good trainer, uh, he's been a good person to us. And a friend, uh, what as a father figure, always, you know, giving us motivation, whatever. So when he was a little bit down, uh, what you guys, we, we have to be with him and support him. I haven't spoke to these, whatever the case. These even told me, say, brother, what you guys, you know, life is, you know, business yeah. is. Yeah. We have ups and downs. Yeah. So I just I hope Mr. Soma does. He's gonna, uh, we love just put us up and uh, what you guys, the babies that we have coming through. Uh, what you just know that what you guys. Uh, we can never turn. Uh, we can never turn our back on you. As much as people, you know, can talk and make rumors and this and whatever the case is, life is as such. Indeed. So at the end of the days, I mean, what you guys, we are the best of times and we are the worst of times. Yeah. So uh, what you guys, now we have to enjoy the, the medium, and uh, what you guys, let's look, let's look forward to the future. Open the summer is going to be ready. What you guys, take me on for the. For a round of golf, yeah. Uh, with myself, him and this, and then uh, what you also to my lucky, yeah, Mr. Uh, Long. Uh, Mr. Long is around. Mr. Long is around, and, and I just want to thank Marlon. It's always, uh, uh, what you Marlon is one of our, uh, our staunch partners. Always not here. He's under pressure in the business, whatever. And then uh, what you, I just want to dedicate this this win to, uh, what you our right hand man, Mr. Diaz Island, and uh, what you. I just, I just want to say, whatever these ladies end on, I'm not talking about uh, whatever. He's now the agent of Serena Mudli, and I can guarantee you in the next couple of months, Serena Mudli will be on the top, not because of his own ability, it's because of these guidance. And I mean, this is, uh, 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 I had a problem of spending maybe two weeks with him in December. And what you guys see is one of the best people I've ever met. Oh, lovely stuff. So, thank and you. of course, uh, whenever we see you and Mr. Long, we know that uh, we've got the green light. Uh, I want to say thank you to Mr. Soma. I know age, age is an effect, but then I'm wishing him a speedy recovery. Thank you so much, and we wish you an enjoyable rest of the afternoon. Two more races to go. So that is Mr. Jin Sammy with the second win as an owner. Well done to Joe Soma, and of course, uh, the uh, partners are uh, E. Niker and uh, MGAS uh, Bloodstock. Nominee Mr. Gabby Sober. That'll be win number four from a 10 outing. That is race number seven as we now look forward to the tail end of the meeting. And if you're still running in any of those exotics, I think uh, the pig six and the jackpots are looking pretty good.